Do you know that now you can create AI documentary videos, just like Dhruv Rathi and Nitesh Rajput, using with nothing but your mobile phone, completely free? Now, I'm demonstrating this on a computer screen, but everything I show can be done on a mobile phone as well. Let's begin by generating a powerful, highly engaging script using ChatGPT. Simply enter this prompt. Just replace the topic with your own and change the language if needed. And within a few seconds, ChatGPT will generate a powerful and engaging script for your documentary video. Next, we need to create the voiceover for the video. You can absolutely record the voiceover yourself, but if you're not comfortable recording your own voice, don't worry. You can use a free AI voiceover tool by visiting openai.fm, which is one of the best free voice generators available right now. Now, go back to your script and copy only the narration part. Avoid copying the narration guides or instructions. Simply select the narration, copy it, and paste it into openai.fm. Since the tool accepts up to 1000 characters at a time, I've added the intro script here as the first segment. Next, choose the voice. Based on my experience, the Ash voice works perfectly for documentary style videos. After that, select the vibe. There are multiple options you can explore, but for documentaries, the true crime buff vibe delivers the most immersive and cinematic feel. Choose it, click the play button, and preview your voiceover. Sabiyo se khara, rahasya ki chadar odhe ek aisa mandir, jaha vigyan bhi ghutne tek deta hai. Once you're satisfied, simply download the generated audio. Repeat the same process for the entire script to generate the full documentary voiceover. Once your voiceover is ready, the next step is to generate visuals for every scene of your AI documentary. But here's an important tip. If you want truly high-quality visuals, never generate direct videos first. Always generate images, then convert those images into videos. And the workflow I'm about to share is something you won't find anywhere else on YouTube. So watch this part very carefully. To generate the images, we first need a perfect text-to-image prompt. For that, I have crafted two extremely powerful, highly optimized prompt templates. And trust me, no one else shares prompts like these. You will find both of these prompts pinned in the comments. In step one, the prompt analyzes image guide provided inside the prompt itself and ask for script. All you need to do is replace the placeholders highlighted in yellow. For example, you can change the theme from here. Since I'm creating a temple-based documentary, I used a Ramayana-inspired mythological theme. You can customize this theme based on your video topic. Now, simply copy this. Step 1 prompt, open a fresh ChatGPT chat, paste the prompt, and ChatGPT will analyze it. It will then ask you to provide your script. Next comes Step 2. In this prompt, you need to replace Jagannath Temple and Lord Jagannath Idol with your own topic and the key element you want to highlight throughout your documentary. After that, you need to paste only a small section of your script, not too long, otherwise ChatGPT may get confused. In this prompt, I've clearly mentioned that ChatGPT should generate one image prompt for each line of the script, so you will get multiple scene prompts in one single output. Again, replace the topic and highlight element with your own. Now copy the step 2 prompt, go back to the same ChatGPT chat, paste it, and then paste the required part of your script right after it. I pasted my entire intro segment here, and sent it. And as you can see, ChatGPT generated detailed text-to-image prompts for every scene, along with scene numbers and the exact script line for identification. This will massively help during editing because you'll instantly know which visual belongs to which line of the narration. Next, to generate your AI images for free, simply copy the scene prompt and visit Meta AI, which is a completely free AI image generator. Click on the Create button, then paste your text-to-image prompt for Scene 1. Make sure the image option is selected. From here, you can also change the aspect ratio. If you're creating a documentary for mobile format, select 9 to 16. But since I'm creating a full horizontal documentary, I selected 16 to 9, and then I hit Send. And bingo! Meta AI instantly generates four images for Scene 1. Choose whichever version looks the best. Repeat the same process for Scene 2, and for every scene in your script. You can see on my screen, I've now generated images for all my scenes. The quality is good, but if you want the absolute best quality, then you must generate high detail enhanced images like these. If you can afford Google Gemini, simply visit gemini.google.com. I already have the pro plan, and honestly, it doesn't cost much. You'll notice that Nano Banana Pro is now available inside Gemini 3 Pro. Click here to try it. Make sure the image tab is selected. Paste your prompt for scene 1 and let Nano Banana Pro generate the enhanced image.
Bingo. Here's the final image for scene 1. Simply download it and rename it so you can identify it later. Repeat this process for every scene. As you can see, I've generated all the images, and just look at the quality. These visuals look like they're taken straight from a high-budget cinematic documentary. Now, we need to turn these images into video clips. Before generating the video clips, we need video prompts. For that, go back to ChatGPT and ask it to create image-to-video prompts for all scenes, including camera movement, action, and cinematic visual effects. ChatGPT will generate these prompts scene-wise. Now copy the video prompt for scene 1 and go back to Meta AI. Upload the scene 1 image, change the mode from image to video, paste your video prompt, and click animate. Within a few seconds, bingo! Your first dynamic video clip is ready. Let's preview it. Just look at this quality. Absolutely mind-blowing. But remember, this level of output is only possible if your base image is high quality. That's why I highly recommend using Nano Banana Pro for generating the images. Repeat the same process for all scenes. Here you can see, all my images have now been converted into dynamic cinematic AI video clips, packed with stunning VFX. Every scene looks as if it has been shot on a cinema-grade camera for a high-budget documentary. Now that all the clips are ready, the final step is editing the documentary. Editing is not as difficult as it looks. You just need to sync your video clips with the voiceover. But here comes the most important part, something nobody on YouTube teaches. How to create intros like Dhruv Rathi and Nitesh Rajput. So let's begin. Open your favorite video editor and import all your clips and your voiceover file. Drag your voiceover onto the timeline first. Let's preview that before moving ahead. To create a cinematic intro like Dhruv Rathi or Nitesh Rajput, we now need to add BGM and sound effects. So import the intro, BGM and sound effect files. You'll find all download links in the description. First, drag the stem melody below the voiceover layer. Let's preview it. Sounds great. Next, import the stems instrument layer below the melody, and then import the stem bass layer right underneath. Now comes the main part, adding the multi-drums to get that Dhruv Rathi slash Nitesh Rajput style punch. But before placing them, we need to preview and decide the perfect timing. So let's play it once. Right after this part, we need to insert the multi-drum. Split the voiceover layer exactly at this point. Now drag the first multi-drum right after the split, then move the remaining voiceover so it aligns right after the first drum finishes. Let's add a second multi-drum as well. Again, split the voiceover layer here, place the second drum after the split, and realign the remaining voiceover. Preview it again. Now bring in your first scene clip and sync it with the voiceover. Let's preview the timing. To make the intro feel more dynamic, add three to four quick images synced to the beat of the first multi-drum. Preview it again. To enhance the cinematic feel, we'll add motion using keyframes. Go to the start of image 1 and add keyframes for scale, rotation. Now move the playhead to the end of image 1, add two more keyframes, set, scale, 115%, rotation, 3 degrees. Now for image 2, at the start, add both keyframes again. At the end, add both keyframes again but set, scale, 115%, rotation, minus 3 degrees. This creates alternating motion, which adds a much more cinematic feel. Repeat the same process for all images. Preview it again. And you'll notice how much more dynamic and cinematic the intro becomes. For the next multi-drum, repeat the exact same process. Split the voiceover. Insert the drum. Sync the visuals. Add keyframe motion to your images or clips. Preview it again. If you want to add more drums or multi-drums, feel free. 
the exact same steps apply. After that, sync the remaining video clips with your voiceover to complete your full documentary. Now let's preview the complete video. सदियों से खड़ा रहस्य की चादर ओढ़े एक ऐसा मंदिर जहां विज्ञान भी घुटने टेक देता है जहां आस्था और चमत्कार सदियों से एक दूसरे में समाये हुए हैं ये सिर्फ एक धार्मिक स्थल नहीं बल्कि एक ऐसा पहेली है जिसे सुलझाने की कोशिशें सदियों से जारी हैं। पर हर बार हर कोशिश नाकाम रही है। The full 17-minute documentary link is provided in the description below. If you watch till here, please like this video and consider subscribing to support the channel. Also leave your feedback and comment in top 5. Comment will win 1 year. Nano Banana Pro subscription for free. And if you want to make your voiceover sound even more cinematic, do not miss the next video. It is absolutely a must watch. See you soon, inside that tutorial.